All right. Let's do a real, 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 real easy. We're going to go to the Encyclopedia. Encyclopedia of Wood. Yeah, those are water bottles down there. Understanding Wood. Who's this guy? All right, so this guy is a, I mean, he's probably dead now because this book is. This book's pretty old, but uh, he was, there you go. You can read University of Tennessee Professor of Forestry. Okay, look at this guy. Who is he? He is Andrew Poinetter. Wow, that's crazy. A hundred types of wood to woodworkers around. That's interesting. What is this all just different random people? Oh, now he, he makes the music. Okay, okay, very interesting. I did not know all this about a tree, the anatomy of a tree. All right, this is the crown, the branches and leaves of the tree were phosphite, phosph, 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 excuse me, photosynthesis takes place. Okay. The roots, the anchor in, or, or the an, yeah, anchor tree and absorb water and minerals from the soil. Makes sense. Also called the stem of bowl supports the tree and channels nutrients to its, from its roots. I mean, that's kind of self-explanatory. But this is pretty, okay. This is the pitch, a small and often pulpy core running in the center. The heart. Okay, look at this. This is some really random information. Um, You know, whatever. Uh, I did not know. I, I've heard of the heartwood, right? But I didn't know that the heartwood was not just like, I thought the heartwood was this entire thing right there. <laughs> I was wrong. It is the entire thing right there besides the absolute middle. And that's the pitch. Wow. So sap wood that has been clogged with resins, gums, and other. Wow. The growth ring. I guess that's the one you count. See how old the tree is. A concentric ring divided into early wood and late wood, indicating the amount of tree, of wood added to the tree's trimmer in one growing season. Well, in one growing season? How long is the growing season? Uh, the ray. What are we looking at, dude? Is it like, these are kind of the same. They're all kind of pointing to the same thing. <laughs> Carries nutrients laterally through the wood, also stores nutrients. So, um, one part of the tree, the bark, yeah. Insulates tree against temperature extremes, keeps sap wood uh, from dying out. So, yeah, wow, a tree really is really, I mean, I understand. And I know that I'm about to say something really stupid, but a tree really is alive. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce it. That's why I didn't try. But it, this is basically like the highway. This is this is what's bringing all this the the goodness ever all around. This thin itty bitty layer, a thin rep rep reproductive layer that forms a new tissue adding to the adding to this, and the sap which in increase the tree's girth. So girth like make it like grr, make it bigger, wider, thicker. Sap wood. We've gone through sap wood a few times. Was were active part of the trees wood through which water and minerals are conducted from the roots to the leaves. Also stores nutrients and helps support the tree. All right, that's actually all. This is pretty interesting. I had no idea. I, I mean, we really weren't going to get into that, but uh, what the fuck? Oh 
Okay, hardwood and softwood. So what's this the difference? I'm guessing this is the softwood and this is the hardwood. I mean, it's a pretty cool picture. Um, that's uh, for this one. I'm I'm literally just gonna go through the anatomy of a tree, uh, and if I have time, maybe softwood and hardwood. But this is, I mean, look at the size of that bad boy. I got some trees, but they're nowhere near that size. And just like, man, this is pretty interesting. If you've ever tried to move wood before, you can, I mean, it is it is not an easy task. Like, wood is really heavy. Like, super heavy. I, I got myself one of the little mini sawmills. And, yeah. Yeah, right. Not happening. Okay, look at this. The different cutting methods. Three methods of sawing logs. You got the plane saw, the quarter saw, and the through. All to make different types of Wow, this is interesting. I wonder how they cut that. It kind of seems like you'd get a lot of waste. But they know what they're doing, so. Yeah, it's a lot more. It's more into it than just buying a little a sawmill thing and cutting things down.